Peace of Christ to all of you. Please invite your friends and don't forget to share this video after we finish. It's going to be a very short video. A few days ago, we made a video about the death of Muhammad and how he died by poison. A Muslim, he posted in my uh, TikTok the answer saying, well, he died and Allah, he saved him. So he died three years later. Muhammad, P-P-U-H, came to confirm what was a true, which is accomplished. And here I find it very weird to say that he was saved, yet he died. As I understand, the one is saved is the one who lived, not the one who died. And he lived for three years in a miserable death. In front of us here, we have a Muslim Shia Sheikh. He explained to you why the death of Muhammad by poison by a Jewish woman who revenge proved Muhammad to be false, if it's a true story. Consumed the poisoned food, it will be a proof of his not being a true prophet. May Allah forbid. This is because it was the Jews and the women who wanted to put the prophet under trial by means of their scheme. Is he truly a prophet who gets revelation from Allah? If he was a prophet, he would know that this food was poisoned and would not consume it. If not, he would consume it. Authentic hadiths provide that the prophet, peace be upon him and his pure family, knew it and did not consume the food. He admonished his retinue not to consume it either. Well, this is the Shia. But why he is saying this will prove that Muhammad is false? Because Muhammad in the hadith, he said, if you try to do that, Allah will not allow you. And later Muhammad, he died by poison. And the Shia, they are saying what they are saying because they want to say that the one who killed him is Aisha, which will not change anything. Does it make a difference if Aisha is the one who killed him? Or it is a Jew? A prophet of Allah was not saved. Jesus was saved. Muhammad died by poison. Share the video, tell your friends, and let us see what the Muslim answer will be. Thank you very much.